high laser dot registration first print I use in landscape mode I print the landscape mode uh, picture with the crop mark the, I call it origin crop mark I insert in in the cutters before I need to power on the machine the head move up and back I place manually the pen tip just over the crop mac origin just over the crop mac origin after that I press the button OK that's mean that my new origin is exactly it's exactly on the crop mark origin now the next step the next step is to place the laser beam to light the laser beam you must press the test button it's hard to see the laser beam when, you have, when we have too much light with the software for the calibration the idea is to move the laser beam over the origin crop mark and we measure the distance with the software on X and Y axis that the philosophy behind the calibration the calibration is a distance between the blade tip or the pen tip and the laser beam position the small one and the blue one the biggest one click the register button to calibrate to calibrate we need to use the arrow to move the laser beam over the crop mark I can use the high precision motion I can use fast motion beginning by fast motion okay if I click the left arrow if I click the down arrow now I can use eye precision just check back eye precision and click The dot disappeared, disappear. that means it's over the crop mark. The dot is just over the crop mark. We have a correction factor 40740. Now I just write here 40740 and I press a minus sign in the front. If I need to test it, the blade move up the color if I press te text again the blade move uh, the laser dot move up the color that for, for my, this machine the correction factor is 400 on X and minus 740 on Y axis click the X button exit the control panel you power on the machine you press the test button to light up the laser beam 
you press the offline mode to come in offline and with the you move the laser dot very near very near the crop back button and you press the OK button that's the new Cut project icon, continue in a way, register, your question factor is here, you just okay. use high precision motion. You just over the corner, take the next step. We have a slight deviation because due to the major on the table, I use the left, uh, the right arrow to to correct the deviation. Maybe uh, the down arrow to correct the major shrinkage. Now I move next step, the third, the third, third dot. Normally, normally you not necessary to make a correction. It's a pair that a small shrinkage I use. It's not necessary, but if you need a very high precision, you have no choice. And next step to go to the to the origin. Now we are ready to cut off the test. I want I, I can cut by color or I can cut the blue outline or the red outline. I can cut by object also. I can select an object and select object. I always only select one. I press start. <laughs> Come back to your region, that's me. You can cut another object. Maybe I can cut the, maybe the red of this, of this object. Selected object is red. I click the start button again. Now you cut, you cut your outline flush to the dry ring. Without effort, you can make a very good work. The precision of this is about 12,000 or 0.3 millimeter without effort. Thanks for watching.